Welcome back, guys. Why is it that every weekend it rains, it seems like here lately? Like during the work week, it's perfect temperatures, it's not cloud in the sky. But during the weekend, when I'm, it's time to fish, and I can get out and actually enjoy it, it starts downpouring, super swell systems are moving through the state. I'm like, oh, what's going on? So we're not going to be out fishing today. But we are going to eat some fish, though. Uh, you know those crappie I caught in that last video? If you haven't watched that, check out the link below. But we are going to cook those crappie today. This is not going to be your ordinary catch and cook video. We're doing something a little different. Well, I went shopping the other day, and I bought an air fryer. I've never used an air fryer before, and uh, so I'm like, hmm, you know, with the New Year's resolutions and... All that stuff, you wanna to try to eat healthier, it's supposed to taste just as great as the traditional route. Well, we're gonna test that out today. So I'm gonna blindfold my wife, and we're gonna give her a crappie taste off. She's gonna taste the old traditional crappie where you pan fry it with some grease, and then she's gonna try the air fry version of it. And blindfold it, because I think, you know, once you fry it in a grease pan, you'll actually be able to tell it, just how shiny it is with that extra oil on there that uh, it was fried in some deep oil So we're gonna blindfold her that way. It makes it a little bit more interesting. So let's go check out the kitchen All right, so my wife is nowhere in sight She's in the back bedroom With the door closed. I told her to make this Fair taste test and without you knowing anything. I want you to be in the back room watching some TV or something so we have our um, traditional pan here with some grease inside there. This is a, actually um, sunflower oil. So we're gonna turn that baby on some medium high heats. And get that oil a cooking. What I love to use, this is one of the best I feel as far as fish fries go, is the Louisiana brand. This is from Walmart. It's the blue package. And it's the seasoned crispy fish fry. Like, you don't have to add any pepper or salt to it. If you look at the sodium and the ingredients, it has salt in it already. And so it's pre-seasoned. You don't have to add anything to it. Really, really simple mix. And over here, this is what I just bought. It's called the Go Wise Air Wise Fryer. As seen on Steve Harvey's show. <laughs> so anyways, this is the air fryer. Now, I did give it a little test trial, not with crappie. But just so I won't burn the crappie and all that with how thin they are, is we did test out some homemade sweet potato fries. Man, they are tasty. All I used was Mrs. Dash table blend on there. But here's the unit here. All right. Inside our refrigerator here. The refrigerator's gonna be a mess. Got some oh, gotta have some old-fashioned famous Milo sweet tea with this meal. So I have uh, my crappie. Soaking in a brine, um, a just salt water. I've had them in there for about 15 minutes, going on 20 minutes. So they are pure and white looking now. They were, you know, they had a little red and pink color to them, but now they look white and store bought. All right, so let's get to it. All right, first we're going to do the air fryer side. So here's my uh, fillets. Oh, they look so beautiful. Now I'm out of paper towels. So I'm gonna have to damp them dry with a, just a, a kitchen towel that's clean. So first, let's pat them dry. Oh yeah. Just a real quick little, dry them out a bit. Then we're gonna put them inside. Here, sorry, this is a two hand job. Oh yeah. Mmm, looks so tasty. Oh, tasty treats, tasty treats. Oh yeah, but before we put it in here, we do have to spray it with some um, oil first. Just keep them from sticking a bit. Right. Okay, that's done. Now we're gonna drop that little puppy right in here. Oh yeah, let's do the next one. This looks like a good chunk right here. Oh yeah, pat it dry real quick. Like I said, I like using paper towels. 
Now you can use an egg batter, usually I'll use an egg batter, but just to keep it um, simple and the taste test to be more accurate, we're going to not change it up too much. Put in the batter, oh, oh those look so juicy. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Oh yeah. Alright, put that dude in there. Look at that. Right, let me shove these puppies inside here. Comes on, power button, manual. If you look over here, you see french fries. Uh, I don't know what that is. I don't know these symbols yet. I'm looking at shrimp, cake, steak, fish. Looks like a fish right here. Alright, I'm saying 20 minutes. And we'll get it rolling. There she goes. Easy as that. It's time for the traditional side of things. My oil and grease, my oil is pretty hot. We'll find out here shortly. Here's just a little test piece. I always like using a little test piece, a little chunk, just to see if it's frying good. Anyways, we'll take this piece. We'll uh, dry it out a little bit. Leave a little moisture just for this to stick to it better. Oh yeah. Mmm, it's gonna be some tasty treats. Alright. Now I like to just put in a uh, one little side just to see. Oh yeah, we got the sizzling going. Alright. It's frying up nicely. That side kind of flopped over a little bit. There we go. Alright. Let's get these others in there. It's already been a couple minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and flip this baby right here. Oh, it's looking so tender and tasty. Go ahead and flip this in here. Literally, they've been in there for two minutes. It'll probably take less than seven minutes to fry them, depending on how hot the grease is. That one's already falling apart. All right. Mmm. We're looking for that golden brown look to them. All right, we're gonna go over here and check the air fryer. So the fish air fryer is set to automatic temperature of 330 degrees Fahrenheit. That's what their presetting is, but you can manually adjust it. We have 16 minutes left on those. About halfway through, it does recommend you pull this out, shake it, that way it doesn't stick to the bottom. These are not the right tongs for this, but we'll have to do. Wish I had a little bit more gripping power, that way I don't uh, break them. That looks nice and golden and brown. So this is how I'm going to remember. Um, I got a just a little post-it note on a toothpick. A is for air fryer. Actually, let's do it backwards because she may think that same thing. So we'll go B for air fryer. B for air fryer. I'm going to stick that puppy right in that fish like so all right now let's go check on the air fryer all right the fryer is done let's take a look they look crispy sorry that's my kids in the background all right let's put this on the plate i'm going to cut it in half that way it looks similar to the other side and it needs to cool off. So I want them both cooled off before she tests them out. Alright. Alright, so remember it's the opposite. So B is for air fryer. A is for the grease. There we go. Okay, we're ready. So I'm going to go get her in the living room. She's got a blindfold on, so I'm gonna have to lead her. All right. All right, honey, reach out for my hand. Right there, okay, stand up. 
Is Let's... this a bird box challenge? Yes. <laughs> uh, All right. Here's I'm already your, scared. I don't here's your I'm chair going. right here. Here's your chair. Okay. okay. You mean pull it out for you? Mm. All right. <laughs> now you don't have any ketchup. She's a big ketchup fan. Okay. But uh, we're going to have to just go blind here. Now, if you reach with your left hand out in front of you, you'll fill a plate here. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So uh, you have this one to try, this little piece in front, and then you have this piece here. I put the toothpicks, the toothpicks, you don't want to eat those, okay? okay? That's what tells us which fish is what. All right, so go ahead and grab that one. So basically you're trying to tell us which one is fried tasting, which one is the air fryer. Right, this which, one? Yeah, so. Okay, this is weird. Normally females don't like to be recorded while they eat, but mm -mm. she's being a good sport. All right, do you want to try the other piece first or do you want to? That's good. Guess now. Tastes good. Nice. I'm going to get some more. I'm a little hungry. <laughs> Sorry you had to wait so long. Mm, okay. These are not her mm. unicorn uh, sleepers, by the way. They're my daughter's. Oh, no, yeah. Sure. Okay. And All I've right. got my vintage Star Wars tea. Nice. All right. So you want to try the other piece or do you want to finish that one off first? I'll finish it off. Okay. That's good. That's good. good. Tastes mm -hmm. good? Mm-hmm. Oh. You want to guess now, or do you want to go to the next piece? No, I want to try the other piece. Okay, so, so reach out in front of you. Which, left hand still? Yeah, left oh. hand right here. Okay. All right, she's got the next piece in her hand. She's going to the mouth. Mmm, that's good. Mm. Now, I'm not the greatest cook, so just on both pieces. But mm. Try to get a piece of that big chunk right here, the big chunk meat. Right. Well, yeah, the thickest part. Oh my gosh. It's I feel like I'm making a big part. mess here. No, no, you're fine. You may <laughs> oh have God. something hanging from your face, but it's totally fine. Oh, that was a big bite. Nice. Mm. Nice. Mm. All right. Hmm. All right. So, uh, the first piece. Mm -hmm. What was your opinion? Do you think it was fried in grease, old traditional style in a pan, or do you think it was the air fryer? And the piece you're eating right now, you can go with the piece you're eating right now. Which one is which? I don't know. I can't tell. I really can't. I don't know. So you can't tell but, the difference. No, on this one I feel like <clears throat> maybe it's like got some more seasoning or something. I'm tasting more seasoning or something like, or breading or more something. More texture. More yeah. Okay. Where's the? Is there any? Is there yeah, other? there's some more right here. You want to try this? Just peel you off another piece. Right here? Yeah. I think you're just liking eating it more than really. I know, I'm hungry. Okay, this one. This one has more, um, like, moisture, I would say. Uh huh. And then where's the other piece that I'm right, to eat yeah. it? Yeah, you can take it. Okay, and this one seems. Here, eat the thick part, not the uh, outside part. There you go. So, one seems like it was like had a little bit more like moisture on the inside. This one seems a little bit more dried out. They both taste really well, mm -hmm. but this one has more seasoning. So the other one I couldn't taste as much like seasoning, where this is more seasoned, uh -huh. and I can taste the seasoning. So you think that one's air fryer in your hand now? So I'm gonna you... go air fryer with the one that's in my hand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, that is yes. correct. What? Nice work. So yes. what's your? You can take the blindfold off. Unless you just uh, love to rock it out. No, it's uh, okay. All right. So in your opinion, you kind of mentioned already, they taste Ugh. similar. Oh my goodness! Look at that hair. Uh. Amazing. You look great. You look great. <laughs> okay. All right. So your overall opinion, the A, the one right here mm -hmm. that you said had more moisture to it. Yeah. That was more. the pan fried with the okay. grease. Mm -hmm. This B it was the air fryer. So in your opinion, to wrap this up, which they both. Taste similar, or you could tell a huge difference in taste and texture. There wasn't a huge difference. There was definitely not a huge difference. They're mm. both good. One seems like there was more moisture on the inside, where the other one was like a little bit drier, but had more. I could taste more of the flavor of the seasoning. So. Oh, okay, great. Well, awesome. So, so uh, overall, did you, are you impressed with the air fryer? Air fryer. <laughs> The air fryer. Yes. All right. So, I think tasty that treats. they, as far as taste wise, to me, they were both good, and um, you couldn't tell it was just a huge difference. But one so. was 
really, really healthy. The other one, not so much. Good right. for occasional treats, but right. this one, the air fryer we can do daily. I'm awesome. Awesome. Well, I'm going to let my wife enjoy her full meal. She is starving. Thanks. She waited a long time for that. Mm. She's earned it. So that wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. Um, I'm not an awesome uh, cooker by all means or baker and all that. So uh, she was impressed. She liked both just as equal. But you can tell the air fryer, it, I probably cooked a little too long. It might have dried it out a little bit. It wasn't as moist as I wanted to. I smell like a huge fried fish and I have all the neighborhood dogs looking at me right now. So I'm going to get inside before I get gnawed on. So uh, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next adventure. See ya!